Well, I am outstanding here in a pumpkin farm, and I'm with Annie Roof. And Annie, what are your cousins doing here? They're not really carving pumpkins like we usually do, so what are they doing? They're carving their names in the pumpkins, so when the pumpkins start to turn orange, it leaves a scar with their names on them. Ah, so when they pick them, when they're all orange, their initials will be in there permanently. Yeah. Well, that's really cool. And you know, here at Al's, um, at the Roof Family Farm, Annie is really a fourth generation Al's. Your grandpa was Al. Yeah. Your great grandpa. So that's pretty cool. So why did you guys grow so many pumpkins? There's a lot of pumpkins here. We grow them for the store and we started for our college tuition. Ah, for you and your brother Greg. Yeah. So really, you guys grow a lot of pumpkins because that's really a big thing in your family. So how many are you doing this year? How many acres do you have? 16. Wow, 16 acres, and is that the same as last year? No, last year we had 14. Wow, so how many pumpkins do you think that you're gonna be sending to the stores this year? Uh, about 40,000. Wow, that is a lot of pumpkins. And I know that you have a lot of different ones, and do you know what varieties that you're growing? Yeah, we have four different ones. There's the jack o lantern pumpkins, and then there's the Cinderella pumpkins, and then the white pumpkins. Oh, wow. You know, they're really a nice selection when you go to the Owl stores. And so do you know when they'll be ready to, for us to come get? Uh, middle of September. Ah, so really not too long. And so if you're growing pumpkins at your house, you can go out there. They're using a, um, a sharp kind of object. They're actually using a um, bottle opener, a can opener, old fashioned one, and scraping away the green on that. And so it's, you don't have to really go too deep, do you? No. Annie, I also noticed they're using a cookie cutter. Is that that's okay too? Yeah, anything with a sharp edge so the impression will stay. Ah, uh, and then do it now when it's green? Yeah, co yes, because when it's orange, it's harder to cut into. Ah, okay. So you heard it here. So if you have pumpkins at your house getting ready to be ripened, you want to do that now, and then you'll have it when you pick it in the fall. Also, you want to get into Al's. It's probably the middle of September or so, and all of the orange pumpkins will be coming in. So make sure that you make a visit out to Al's and see this great crop of pumpkins. Well, thanks so much for the tip, and thanks, you girls. You did a great job. You're welcome. <laughs>